so somebody emailed me and they asked about uh, horizontal spinning ideas for what to do horizontally um, and there's so much to do horizontally that and it's such a good question that I'm gonna do a whole series but today we're gonna talk about uh, some good good ideas for getting started on playing horizontal um, basically the first thing is you just want to you want to get good at actually being horizontal um, because people tend to let it tilt or they go up and they, they lose their planes a lot. The beauty of spinning horizontally works the best if you're really, really horizontal. So a good thing to do is to stand over uh, near a table, right? And then you actually have a horizontal surface to work with. And what you want to do in the beginning is simply play with going up like a helicopter and down like a helicopter. Up like a helicopter and down like a helicopter. And if you have a table or a flat surface, it helps to see if, uh, if you're actually staying horizontal. And at our retreats in Costa Rica, we're actually going to build round tables with a hole in the middle so you can stand and have the surface all around you. And then you can really play a lot of horizontal stuff. But, uh, you know, come to Playpoint to find out more about that. But uh, you want to keep going up and going down. And then I recommend making like a hoop with your arms. Right? And once it's very smooth, you feel like you can helicopter up, helicopter down, you can add this. On your way up, if you're going clockwise, I'm going to the right, I let my left elbow lead, and I go through the hoop on the way up. On the way down, I let my left elbow lead, and I go through the hoop on the way down. Right? So I'm below, through, above, above, through, below until you can just flow with that and you really want to relax into it so i can do one beat in each below through above through below through above through or i can do a few below a few through a few above a few through a few below and so i'm helicoptering down helicoptering up helicoptering down helicoptering up you want to do that in both hands of course again clockwise First, just below and above. And then again, same elbow. My left elbow leads up. So I'm still going clockwise, left elbow leads up. You can do it the other way too, but it's kind of like anti-spinning it a little bit, so it's a bit more awkward. And I recommend really letting that become smooth. When you can do it with both smoothly, you can do add both. Start with just a corkscrew, and then start adding so in the middle, above, in the middle, below. So then you start getting this whole elevator thing happening. You go up, down, up like a helicopter, down like a helicopter. And that really adds a whole other level to play with because you got your corkscrew and your four beat corkscrew, which we'll talk about in another video. But then you add all of this and that just means you can take as much time with it as you want, right? So you're playing above, below, and doing all this kind of stuff. Just really lets you sort of freeze time and go as slow and dramatically as you want. And adding the turns really increases that. You're above, take your time, take your time. Uh, there's big holes in the ground, which makes that a little difficult, but, um, but that's basically a really good thing to start with. And uh, come back, and I'll put up a whole series and all the stuff. And, uh, and then we'll make a video at the end showing how to put it all together. So, uh, helicopter. Whoa.